it sounds a little bit sombre, but it's our final day of the vlog. And, and we're knackered. That's true. Yeah, so tired. We've got a 20 to 6 flight tonight, so we're checking out the room. Bags are packed. It's five past six in the morning. Yep. We've been up since five. We got to bed at half past 11 last night. No wonder we're tired. We're running on about five and a half hours sleep every night this week. But we get nine hours of plane time on the way home. Yay. Whether that means sleep or not, I hope it does in my case. I might sleep a bit. I'm going to yeah. try and sleep a bit. But, but we'll yeah, it's, it's been an incredible week. I want to say a huge thank you to everyone who's followed us, sent us messages, wishes Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. Yeah, everyone that we've met up with in the park. Yes. And been, out the park. It's been amazing, it really has. Been out with a lot of friends this trip. Yeah. Yeah, coming to Disney now is very different from pre COVID. What, yeah. It used to be, oh, okay, we should go to Disney, but now a lot of it is like, we've got so many friends that we've made in the Disney space. Let's see if we can catch up while we're here. Yeah. And, and some of some of our friends we did miss. Yeah. Um, either just because we were travelling and travelling out on kind of crossing ships in the night. Yeah, that's true. And also, also or just because also we never be, being in the park. Is different Christmas week, especially for if you're locals, because not everyone's got yeah. the Incredible Pass, which gives you access over um, Christmas week. The locals, yeah. So, a huge thank you to everyone. Um, and yeah, what's our plan for today? So, the plan for today is Animal Kingdom. Oh. We're hoping, well, we're planning on Everest, yep. and we're planning on the new Nemo show. We had hoped to do both Lion King and Nemo. But we're not really going to have time to get from one to the other. Queue for one, do do it, and then get to the other one. Yeah, we might be able to if it was summer. Yeah. But Or when it's quieter and slightly quieter ones. But as it's Christmas, the queue for Lion King was huge the other day. We're expecting the same today. So we're just going to go and do the Finding Nemo show um, featuring, hopefully, Katie Wetzel. Hopefully. Hopefully who's hopefully it. playing Dory. I'm, I don't know. It, it's always that weird thing on travel day home because there's part of me that thinks like okay let's go to the park let's enjoy it but then also pubs like, oh, just no you need to get to the airport and all that sort of faff and there's a part of me that goes oh a bed sleep that's true so okay what's your quick review of this room that we've, we've said in our entire week oh it's perfectly fine it's perfectly serviceable i love it for for what we paid yeah great value close to we haven't spent much time in it so we've oh. slept in it and that's about it yeah Watch the occasional bit of TV, as in, like, we put the news on in the morning on one day. One day. Yeah. Maybe two. I think we did it on the first day. And also, there's no Walt Disney World Today channel anymore. Yeah, so the telly's probably been staying off a bit more than it would have. That is true. But, yeah, no, we've just got to make sure we've got bags. We know where passports and we know where everything is. But I think everything's all packed, ready to go. We've got coats to carry, which sounds really weird. Oh, but beginning sorry. Of, beginning of the week, it was very cold. Yep. Oh, the difference, what well, difference a couple of days, mate. So we will catch up with you when we're in Hanon Kingdom. Let the spirit of the season guide you and your adventures. Welcome to Disney's Animal Kingdom. Here we are in Animal Kingdom. Well, really you say that, let's see what happens. You can just about see Everest. Okay, so how, missed, how are your nerves this morning? Because I know. Not too bad, actually. Maybe it's because I've done. This a few times. Done it a few times. I've done Guardians yeah. this trip and Tower of Terror. We're here just for the early entry to get in this morning. We're not doing Genie today because it's only a half day for us. Because yeah. we're going to the airport later. There's no point. Thirty nine pound for or well, twenty nine dollars each. It's yeah. like for what we're planning on doing. Yeah, doesn't seem worth it. No, and so especially when you can't park up either. It's not like we're planning can... on Everest. We're planning on breakfast, Mickey and Minnie, me, Mickey and Minnie, and the. Um, New North Nemo show. Yeah, I can't wait for to see that. It'll be really good. And um, if we could squeeze in a safari, you never know. If we could squeeze in a safari, great. But that's not our priority. It's not our priority because we've done it once this trip. Yeah. That's 
They one person oh, just in the morning and then they all get Attention expedition ever state members. On this ride. That's really good actually. I enjoyed that. I hope you saw some of that. I really do. Guardians has helped on backwards I put my glasses on to begin with <laughs> because I did want to lose them. So that was fun. Doing Guardians has helped. Yeah, I think you're right. That's good Yeah, it is. If you would like to do something more to help us with conservation, talk to one of the villagers in Hatta. Quite possibly the last ride in Holland. Yeah. You see all the names, let's go. Yeah. Yeah. John yeah. Lawrence, my name's Riley. I'm here for a guy today out here on the Harambe Wildlife Reserve. A couple of safety reminders before we head on in. Everyone's got to stay seated, keeping those hands, arms, feet, and legs inside this truck at all times. Now, if you do drop something from the truck, unfortunately, we cannot stop to pick it up. So just let us know at the exit. We'll try our very best to help you out. Uh, this first area we are entering this is the military rainforest and a lot of animals out here have very good natural camouflage so keep that sharp eye out and you never know what you're going to see there's a big black and white bird over here to the left side of the truck and now that is a saddle build stork now looking at that one that is a female saddle build stork and i can tell that by looking at the color of her eyes so that bright yellow color now her wingspan is going to be about nine feet wide which is about as wide as this truck um, she's also a very solitary creature so all of her time will be spent alone um, if you do see two of them together um, that means they've mated and those birds do mate for life horns which is made of keratin which is the same stuff as our hair and our fingernails now due to this poaching there is now over on the left here, these are African painted dogs. Now African painted dogs out in the wild are the most successful hunters, with about a 90% success rate with their hunt. Now, pack of painted dogs will always be led by an alpha male and an alpha female. Each one of those spots on those painted dogs are all unique to their own as well. No two painted dogs are the same side of the truck. Now I can tell that's an African elephant by looking at the shape of their ears. They're in the shape of the continent of Africa. Now a herd of elephants will always be led by the oldest female. It will actually be the female lions that go out and do the hunting. The males, they stay back, they protect the pride and the lands that they live on. And she got way up there, huh? I can tell that these two that we can see are female. Um, they do not have the manes. The males will have that big majestic mane around their necks. The females will not. Hello everybody. So we are... What have we done this morning? We have 
Um, Everest, the safari, and had breakfast. Yeah, we had creature comforts. Half comfort, past nine. Creature comforts for breakfast. We did. We very nearly went to Tosca House. Yeah, we looked at it. It was a ten minute walk up, but we thought. Yeah, we're gonna... this is supposed to be a budget trip. Yeah, so we're going to save save that for June. Yeah. So we've had a plan for June for character breakfast. Yeah. So we will tell you more about that at a later date. Yeah, next, but, next time. Yeah. But, um, uh, we're in the queue to see Mickey and Minnie. It's close to the 45 minute wait. We've been in the queue for 10 minutes. So let's see how long it takes. It's, we haven't met Mickey or Minnie yet this trip and it's no. our last day so we need to make sure we do. We haven't done this particular meet and greet in about five years. So. Yeah, because it was closed in COVID and was one of the last ones to be open. Hello, how are you? Hey, Lily. Hello. 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 Okay, do that. There you go. Can you scan your phone to get your magic pen on the time? Oh, little door opens too. You're good? Yeah. That was lucky. That's so cool. So we're in the queue, the standby queue for. Oh, finding Nemo, the 11 o'clock show. What's the name of the title? Of the show? Finding Nemo, Big Blue and Beyond. Big Blue and Beyond. So, new show for. Um, we, we missed this by missed a week. Well, less than that. We were out here in June and it was. Yeah, three or four days. So, they were doing cast member previews that we missed out. Well, but, we're not cast members, but. No. But we missed out on. Yeah, we missed out on the public opening. But. So glad to actually do this finally yeah. last. And um, yeah, we always love Fest of the Lion King. And I know it's a split topic amongst everyone on the team. Practically 50 50. It is pretty much. So we'll have to see whether everyone else on the team agrees once we've seen this new one. Yeah. Or someone else has seen the new one. So we look forward to seeing this. The Marine Life Institute houses many aquatic species, including fish from the wild who need our help. Like the group we found in the bay, floating in plastic bags. For these, we remember the three R's. Rescue, rehabilitate, and... Release! Today is the day! Oh, look at all the visitors who came to see us all! Yeah! Hi, little fella! You know, I bet they're wondering how we even ended up here. Listen up. <laughs> These travelers have come a long way, and they deserve a good story. So we're going to do this the way we do everything. Together. Now, it all started. Oh, when, oh, uh, when Marlin met a blue tank named Dory. No, 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 it's when they found that mess. No, no, oh. no, it's when they escaped those sharks. That part's scary. Oh, no. <laughs> Nope. It all started with a little clownfish named Nemo. Nemo? Dad! Dad! It's time for school! All right, we're excited. <laughs> it's your first day of school, Nemo. We are ready to learn, to get some knowledge. Come on! Okay. Hey, Dad. Hello everybody, Hello. so we are at MCO Terminal C, so we've had a lovely last day. Yeah, it's been yeah. brilliant. Yeah, we popped to Animal Kingdom Lodge for some lunch. Yeah, we did. That was really nice, and also we went to explore there because we're staying at Jambo um, in June. Also we just like the resort. Yeah. Yeah, it was, it was really nice, and it's 
it's so relaxing and peaceful. And nice to just wander for As we're at Animal Kingdom on our last day, it made sense to be to one of the closest resorts. And we were, then we got back to All Star, picked up our luggage, sorted it all out, sorted to swap some stuff over because we bought some stuff and yep. wanted to make sure that everything was weighing correctly in the right bags. We did quite well actually. We did. One of us was slightly under and one of us was slightly uh, over. 22.4 for one, 23.5 for the other. But so, I did notice. Um, before we put any bags on there, the uh, 0.2 was already showing, so... Okay, so it's... Yeah. It, it's perfectly fine, but the one next to us was 25.9, so I don't... They just wrote heavy on our bags and just wrote there was 23 kilos. So, so yeah. Yeah. Um, badge check was easy, security was easy and normal. It yeah. about five or ten minutes. Yeah, really, really quick. We were expecting a longer queue yeah. being New Year's Eve. But it was perfect. Apparently night. it's all like going from A and B instead. Yeah, we looked at it and was like at least an hour just for security. So I'm glad we're in Terminal C, which doesn't happen what normally say. But we've had a little bit of explore here. We've had a wander around the Universal Orlando store. Well, that's a little bit different to um, Terminal A and B. Yeah. In that all of the stuff, so the food, the shops, etc., is after security. Not before. Not before. So if you want to buy stuff like drinks or any any other stuff like liquids or snow yeah, globes, yeah, all and your last minute that sort of thing. It's all afterwards. Yeah. So actually, it's quite quite nice. Isn't it? It's nice to explore. So you get security done, and then you can just go and enjoy and explore the rest. But beware if you do want to if you did want to go in the shops, and we're hoping to put it into your whole luggage. You won't be able to. You won't be able to. Because you'd have dropped your bags off already. But yeah, there's a lovely um, picture behind us of um, Castle. Cinderella Castle. Right outside the Disney store. Yeah. Ben might go in and buy a t-shirt that he's their design on. So it's been an incredible week. I want to say a huge thank you to everyone that we've met in the park. Mm -hmm. We've yeah. met some friends, we've met some people that we've been meaning to catch up with for a long time. And it's just, we've had amazing time with some fireworks, yeah. just done a lot of new stuff. We've endured cold, freezing temperatures. Yep, we've still got our coats. Yeah. Which will be useful for when we get back to the UK, to be fair. Yeah. Well, we're going to Manchester and then we've got the four hour drive home. So I thought we'd wrap it up here because I'm not sure how the flight's going to go and then we've got the four hour. We'll probably take some pictures, might film a bit on the flight on the way home. Who yeah. knows? But um, there will be a whole vlog coming. So this is not the exact end of the series, but it's the, it's the end of the Although, Orlando part of the series. Be warned, we've said that before and then never done them. So. so. But we might post all the stuff that we bought on yeah. our socials. And talking of socials, you can find us at the Great British Mickey Waffles at GB Mickey Waffle on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And our website is gbmickeywaffle.com. Thank you for everything, the, all the messages, everything that we've been just. It's just been yeah. an amazing time this week. It really has. And, and if you liked this video, please tick the like button. Um, if you're not already subscribed to the channel, please do so. We would love for you to carry on watching. Especially if you've enjoyed what we've done this week. And also all the, find out all the other stuff that we do, because we have podcasts, live shows, vlogs, and a lot more. We've got so much planned for 2023. And there's just one thing left to say. Waffle on. Waffle on, Merry Christmas, and happy a Happy New Year. New Year. Happy 2023.